It's the GMC Canyon for people who actually like driving their canyons in canyons. This is the GMC Canyon AT4, which replaces the all-terrain as the off-roadiest canyon in the lineup. It features a specially tuned suspension, aggressive all-terrain tires, and a full-time 4x4 system with a low-range transfer case and automatic electronic locking rear differential. And this particular canyon has been equipped with an optional off-road performance package that adds unique black wheels and trim, rock rails, a full array of aluminum underbody skid plates, plus deletes the front air dam and lifts the front end of the truck to help you get over more rocks and access even more terrain. The AT4 starts at 39 and a half grand with cloth seats and just over 41 with this snazzy leather upholstery. And it's available only as a crew cab, but with a choice of long or short beds. It comes standard with a 308 horsepower V6 that's good for 7,000 pounds of towing, 1,531 pounds of payload, and a highway fuel economy rating of 24 miles per gallon, all solid for the mid-size pickup class. But the Canyon's diesel engine is also available for about $4,500 more, depending on the model. The Canyon has been on sale for over a half decade, and while it's not the oldest truck, it also doesn't have all of the latest high-tech equipment. There is a collision warning system and lane keeping assist, but no adaptive cruise control or automatic emergency brakes, which don't do you a lot of good out here. But its standard hill descent control very much does. It's also not a high performance off-roader like its show-off cousin, the Colorado ZR2. It's more of a chill cruiser for grungy roads. This has a good ride on or off-road, although the knobby tires are a little stiff on pavement. While the more luxury-oriented Denali remains the top of the heap in the Canyon lineup, it costs a little more than this, the AT4 really suits this truck better. It's what it was meant to be, and it's how it lives its best life. In the 2021 GMC Canyon AT4, Gary Gastelou, Fox News.